Hi guys, how are you doing? Uh, you've seen the title and the thumbnail, so we presented Aguero with the Player of the Month award. And that was amazing. That was an incredible experience. Um, we saw all the players. We, uh, we were sat there waiting and stuff and all the players were walking past us and it was like pretty surreal. And uh, we saw Pep as well. Uh, I think the highlight for me was um, somebody teaching Pep what A up means. And Pep wasn't getting it. And then eventually he was like, oh, right, OK. And then people were walking in the building and Pep was saying, A up, A up. It was hilarious. Um, incredible, yeah. So, you know, it's amazing that we can do these things and share these experiences with you guys with these videos. Um, and uh, yeah, so we did that. And Aguero's got a new player of the month. So we need to talk about that and uh, decide... Uh, well, have a look at the card, decide if I should get him. He was a really down-to-earth guy, and I think just a uh, you know, really good role model as well, Aguero, De Bruyne as well. Um, both those guys, uh, fantastic role models for the game. So drop a like on this video, guys. You know, we'll aim for, I don't know, over 5,000. Subscribe, turn on notifications. We do two FIFA videos every single day. And uh, yeah, join the channel, join our FIFA journey. So yeah, guys, as you can see, Sergio Aguero, player of the month. I will be getting this card. It might be a really good super sub, or it might be a good starting player. But I think I'm going to do him. We'll try him out. But yeah, as you guys seen by the... Thumbnail, we did meet Aguero yesterday and we presented him with the uh, Player of the Month award. And what an absolute honour to do that. I mean, we're so lucky. In the last week or two weeks, me and Chris have met De Bruyne. We made a video with him and we've met Aguero and given him the Player of the Month. Absolutely incredible. I mean, Jesus, it's crazy. So thanks to EA as well for giving us those opportunities. We were just sat there waiting for Aguero to turn up. We were literally sat there for about two hours and we were just watching all the players coming out after training. And it's just all walking past, man. It was crazy. It was it was amazing. And it's just really weird seeing the players just walking around in, like, the normal clothes, just, like, chilling. It's crazy. But, yeah, we didn't, like, hassle any of them or anything because, you know, they're in their environment of, like, training there. It's practically, like, where they live. And it's, like, you know, they, they don't expect to be, like, you know, pestered for pictures and stuff like that. But, yeah, it was... It was amazing. What an amazing day and an amazing honour to meet Aguero and present him with that play of the month. So I will be getting that sorted at some point for sure. So tonight we've got a new promo and uh, yeah, it's all going on now. So player of the month Aguero. I want to have a look at his card and uh, see his stats. So 93 rated straight away. A contender to go into my team. 88 pace. That's good enough, I suppose. You'd like to see the 90, but 94 shooting, 93 dribbling. Amazing. 84 passing, 82 physical. So uh, we were talking about Aguero the other day, and I was saying not many people have him in their team. He's one of those players, one of the best in real life, one of the best strikers ever in the Prem. But in FIFA, you don't see many people use him for whatever reason. Now, I think height could be one of those reasons. This FIFA, uh, I think taller strikers are more uh, prolific. Um, but what is Aguero's jumping stat? 90. So that's interesting because um, I'm thinking, is he going to be good in the air? Because he's quite small. But 90 jumping, well, that's interesting. I mean, Cannavaro, again, a small player, but he's got a really good jumping stat. And actually, Cannavaro was winning more headers than me, than taller centre-backs, honestly. So Aguero, to put it simply, I'm going to be getting this Player of the Month card and uh, giving him a go for sure. Um, I don't know how much he's going to cost right now, but I'm going to do him over the next few days. I mean, guys, when's the best time to do an SPC? What do you think? Shall I wait three, four days, wait a week, or just do it now? So what I'm going to do here to kickstart this weekend, well, I mean, it's Friday, but to kickstart, you know, the, uh, the weekend videos, I'm going to play my first Foot Champs game, and we're going to go in with our standard team, with no changes, uh, but over the next few days, don't be surprised if I do try some new players. Like I say, we'll probably bring in Player of the Month Aguero, so it's going to be a weekend of trying new things for fun. All right then, so as you can see in the background right now, I literally did this about an hour ago, and I just thought, screw it, let's just play a game now, because I was sort of waiting around and stuff, so I thought, let's do a game now, and let's get this Thierry Henry in the squad. So we finally got him, we sold the left mid, and obviously we got Nedved in there right now, 
um, who I'm actually going to run on a basic chemistry style. I like to do that with new players sometimes, just try them out first and see where sort of the imp need improving, maybe the pace, maybe the physicality, whatever. But yeah, we're leaving Nedved on basic and we get Henri up in here and I think he's got the dead eye on him. So we try him out with the dead eye. We bought him with that. So sometimes I do that as well. I just try it on what I bought him on. And then I change things around if I need it. But yeah, Deadeye increases the shooting and passing. So I think that's a pretty fair kind of chemistry style to try out on Henri there with him lacking in the passing a little bit there. And the shooting, obviously you always need shooting in the strikers. So that is the team that we've now got, guys. Absolutely incredible. And Ibrahimovic does take it to the bench. So we're going to play our first foot champions game here, guys. And we're going to see how that gets on with our new squad. So when I do get player of the month Aguero, it's going to be tricky in terms of formation, what formation I start with. We've had this chat. This guy's got Red Aguero, Sané, Cruz, Fabinho. He's got a good team there. Some good players. So first game. Um... Yeah, what formation am I going to start with? We've had this chat. I don't want to drop any of my midfielders, so it's really difficult. Anyway, let's play this game and try and get um, a win in our first game. Let's see how this goes. Here we go again with foot champs. We've played some rivals in the week. I've enjoyed that, actually. I enjoyed playing some rivals. We're trying to get Division 1 there. But no rivals now until Monday, Tuesday. It's all about foot champs, the foot champs competition to try and get the best rewards that we can. Play it through. That's a good ball. Neymar now. Mbappe, keep running. Go on. That's it, Mbappe, play it through, play it through, that's it, first time! What a save from David De Gea. Hazard has got to be scoring that, and he's paused it. He's going to make some changes early on here, 10 minutes. That was a good chance, that. All right, try again, good ball, Mbappe on the ball. Play it, Mbappe, that's it, play it again. Kante! What a finish from Kante, what a finish. Outstanding. His finishing is amazing, team of the year, Kante. A good pass, a good finish, 1-0. We've dominated this game so far. We've got to win this one now. Here's De Bruyne on the ball. To De Bruyne again. First time, good. Mbappe. Get it to De Bruyne. That's it, guys. Surely De Bruyne. Oh, my God. What a save again from David De Gea. We've got to score that. Marcelo's corner. Ramos is going in there. All right, he's got a chance coming here. Don't score. I've dominated this. No, I don't like this. I don't like... Oh, my God. Oh, I can't even be bothered moan. I can't even be bothered. De Bruyne on the ball. Play it through. That's it. Play it through. That's it. Neymar. No! God damn it! Oh, this is getting frustrating. Vieira plays it. De Bruyne first time it. Good. To De Bruyne again. Pass it again. Play it through to Kante. Guys, Kante on the ball. Play it. Oh, win it. Kante. Oh, it's so hard to break him. De Bruyne, I'm finessing it. Oh, no! <laughs> I can't score! Alright then, so we're going to get into our first foot champs game here, guys. And you're going to see the team that we're about to play. And it's the first team that I've come up against that is actually like a lower rated team. Like, I've had some really bad starts to foot champs in the past sort of couple of months. But this is the first team I've come up against, which actually, which was a nice refreshing change for once. But anyway, here's the team that we're about to play. It's still a very nice team. It's a very capable team. It depends, you know, how good the opponent is at this point. You know, he's, he's got a lot to do. But anyway, here we get through there with Henri. And first of all, we thought, oh, we got Henri. He's missed that chance there. So it was starting to become one of them games where I couldn't score. As you can see, 42 minutes. We were struggling. But here, we get through with Pele with a great ball from Henri. Just waiting and holding with that ball. And Pele, for some reason, he left foot sit. I don't know why. But here, check out this. Pele with his classic finesse shot from outside the box. He's really starting to just, like, shine now, man. Fiera, play it through, he's onside. Neymar, play it in the box. It's De Bruyne, hit it! Again, it's a joke. It's a joke, it's not on, man. I should have scored here. Fiera, Hazard. Fiera again, plays it through, get it in the box. Oh, Jesus Christ. Fiera on the ball to Hazard. Hazard to De Bruyne. Guys, De Bruyne, there we go. That one's going in. Kevin De Bruyne. What a finish. A really good finish, finally. Straight away in extra time. It's game over. We've got the win uh, to kickstart this weekend league. Kevin De Bruyne saving us there with that finish. Um, I'm not happy, though. I mean, we should have killed that game off. You know, we were very comfortable. He was really good on the ball, though, I've got to say, when he did have attacks. 
Very difficult to tackle him, but we're kickstarting this weekend with a win. Now, in this first game, though, we were starting to think, like, Henri's still not scored yet. We're 2-0 up. Henri needs to score. So, um, well, check out this, guys. We get it onto his left foot here, and I just think, screw it. Let's bang it. And, oh, my God, guys, you saw my reaction right there on the left there. Just like, what the? What did I just do? What did I just witness? What a strike on his left foot. So we're 3-0 up at this point, guys. And just check out this pass from Cannavaro here. Right at the start of this clip. I thought it's so underrated, that pass. He just places it right far up the pitch. It pushes all my players up. Fantastic. Nedved here on the right does absolutely fantastic, guys. Uh, Nedved's working really nicely. But here, Henri does the drag back. Does a little bit of moving there. And look at that. The dribbling is absolutely incredible. You know, he does have that little bit more pace than Ibra, and you really do feel that. And yeah, he's, he's just, he's going to work better than Ibra. Oh, the game's not over yet, guys. Nedved's yet to score. Boom! I don't know what, whether that was bad goalkeeping, though, or just a really good shot, but... Yeah, Nedved scores there with a bit of a, a, a soft shot, I'm not going to lie, but it was it was nice to see, I guess, Nedved score anyway. But here we get it to uh, Henri, and Henri does a little fake shot, and it just falls to Pele there, um... So yeah, we end up winning that game, the first game of Foot Champs, 6-0, guys. So, I mean, it's a really positive start for myself. You know, it builds up my confidence here right at the start. And yeah, we just absolutely smashed that, guys, 6-0. And we've got players scoring there that we wanted to score. we got Pele scoring, we got Henri scoring, we got Nedved scoring. I mean, who else do you want to score there, man? Absolutely fantastic. So the team is just brilliant. Cannavaro, guys, is a 10 out of 10. He is... He's so good. Yeah, we're looking good, guys. Hopefully, we're going to have a good weekend league. Hopefully, fingers crossed. And, um, yeah, what a start, guys. What, a, what an incredible start for us there. <laughs>